Hi, I'm Laverne Cox, and you're watching Out at the Center. Let's do it. Young people from the center's Youth Enrichment Services, yes, and seniors from Services and Advocacy for Gay, Lesbian, Bisexual, and Transgender Elders, SAGE, came together at Caring Community for an intergenerational learning experience led by Older Adults Technology Services, OATS. For 10 weeks, LGBT youth mentored seniors in basic computer skills under the guidance of an OATS facilitator. Let's meet some of the participants from this unique learning collaboration between queer youth and seniors. It's the first of its kind uh, with relation to the LGBT Center and working specifically with queer older adults and queer youth. Um, up until now, we have done programs with youth and seniors, but this is the first time we've sort of brought the two groups together. My name is Renee Martinez, and I work for the organization called OATS. I'm the computer instructor here at the Karen Community Center. So I teach the seniors how to use computers and then I also train the young adults how to work with the seniors, interact with them. I just knew I wanted more experience and I figured this was a really good way because not only you're helping someone, you're also learning from them. It's a 10 week course and they meet twice a week. It's a basic introduction to computers. How to get online, how to use email, how to search the web, but also just basic things like how to turn the computer on and move the mouse. I'm totally ignorant when it comes to computers and I thought it's just silly not to know at this age. I email a lot and receive a lot of emails, but that I already knew how to do. What, I, what I'm here for are the other skills of the computer itself and working with, I guess, Windows, different programs are they called or different whatever. See, I don't even know computer language. I want to change that in my life. The course was advertised uh, through the SAGE uh, newsletter. It comes out once a month. I heard about this free, wonderful class, so I asked if I could do it. I want to learn more and more about it because I think it's a very exciting course. There's lots to learn on the computer, which I just totally ignored before, but now I feel that I've got to get with the, you know, the internet, your emails, answering, talking to friends, on the computer, which is something new to me, and it's sort of exciting. Plus, the instructor is extremely good and she's very patient with everybody. Uh, Renee, she is fantastic with people. She's also fantastic with people, I think, in my age group who tend to be a bit reticent in front of technology. A lot of people, as we get older, they think, oh, well, those young people, they're just tech freaks and they won't take any time with us or they won't care about us. And I found that's just the opposite. The interns are extraordinary. They have infinite patience. <laughs> I think it surprised me that they actually learned how to use a computer because I thought I would have a hard time teaching them. You know, it could be a little frustrating to have to tell somebody to do the same thing like every week every week you know for the first four or five times they do it how do i get online where's the internet how do i get online oh there's a lot of frustrating moments of course i think them just getting what i'm actually saying is good because sometimes that can be confusing so the fact that they can get it and they actually remember it sometimes you have to repeat and after a while you don't have to repeat it anymore so once they get it that's an accomplishment. First of all, it's practice makes perfect with this kind of a thing. And my problem is when I get home, and I, ha I do have a laptop, and so occasionally I'll say, oh, I better get on it so I'll know what the hell's going on for the next week. And the youth, uh, you know, get the, to these great teaching skills, and they get to hear stories, and a lot of times seniors, they find something on the Internet, and it sparks up a conversation about something they used to know. And, and so the youth are learning a lot, too, about history and things that they don't really think about. I've learned to be a bit more confident, a bit more sure of myself. And then on top of that, they're fun. There, there have been um, several funny moments. Uh, nothing too dirty. They Googled Oprah Winfrey. Nothing too dirty. They wanted to know her birthday. Yeah, so much information you can get. There's like Google, whatever you want, you'll find that. You know, biographies, uh, the news, the movie reviews. I, I knew the rudiments of the computer, but that was about all. I didn't do any Googling, 
which I'm doing now. We've done a lot of medical research in the class, which I found fascinating. I think the most popular research topic was finding drugs to cure diseases. The other day we actually taught them how to buy tickets online. It's really practical, the skills that they learn. There are a lot of seniors who would appreciate this course. I've learned a lot beyond what I would call the basics. and been very, It's been very, very helpful. Everybody should learn how to use a computer. It's taken me all these years to make that decision, and now I'm very gung-ho. I want to learn everything about it. I want to be a computer expert. And that's all for this excerpt from Out at the Center. If you want to see the full show, check it out on our website at gaycenter.org slash out. Until next time, I'm Laverne Cox. Stay in the love.